were globally, where we were spending, how we were doing, what our projections are for 2024, with the US elections coming, and with the Olympics in Paris this year, our budget was higher up by about $50 million or something. All of these numbers were going above my head. And only then I was like, wow. The feeling that we are in, in a sense, like what Professor Biswas talked about, a borderless world, Retain your identity, but in the end, eventually, blood flows in us. We're all humans. And to look at each other, and to not think about that when you're, when, you're, when you're working in your profession, but to learn from the best that you have, and to give and to give, like Father George said, to give and to give, because when you give, you get back. But again, students, you cannot give if you don't have it. So this is one thing I really want to advocate also, self-care. We forget. There's a lot of talk about mental health now, and it's not, it's not simple. Um, we Nagas, we have a tendency, I think, correct me if I'm wrong, but it's not good to generalize, but we don't like to boast about ourselves, right? So my daughter is going to another school, in boarding school in class 11. So during her interview, they asked her, do you play the music, do you play sports? And she's like, no, I don't, no, I don't. And then somebody else, Anaga, who, who teaches there after the interview, came up to her and said, coordinator, Dr. Father George Rino Pesadico, respected Dean of Science, Father Peter Solo, the HODs of the different departments of the PG, Postgraduate, the representatives of the Students Council of St. Joseph's College from PG Block, the faculty members from PG and UG, invitees, Students Council of the College, and you, my dear friends. Welcome to the third Eurodite Fest of the postgraduates. Two years ago, we started for the postgraduate students. And the intention, the purpose, and the vision, and the goal, aims of this fest is to disseminate and also build up in the students interest, love, and passion for academy, or academic activities. And therefore, this event of today and tomorrow is purely mainly, mainly based on the academic exercises. And that's something which is a very big leap and a very, very big step. And so we have come here for this very important pro this very important program. Father Benny, what a what a host he was. Whenever I had come, he would be the first person to receive me. When my wife came here, he was there with a flower. He was the best. <laughs> now he's a bishop, a very well deserved uh, promotion. Father Joy, my very good friend, even now we are in Dutch, who would flamboyantly declare, I am your joy. <laughs> I remember Sister Lucy and me then principal, Father Sebastian, who first contacted me for a teacher with PhD to start the PG department of English and I recommended my best scholar Dr. Sumi to start the department as the HOD. So Jit Singh and friends, you are the students of my students. Hence you are my grand students. <laughs> so who am I? I am your grand teacher. <laughs> I have been teaching in the Northeast for around 38 years now and I feel at home in class when I am with the bright young faces. It is such a blessing to see my students doing well in exams and graduating with flying colors. They are the human resources for the nation. We are creating the human resources, the future of the nation and you know what? This profession. Michael Bizo, Peter Bizo, proprietor MS TV and Co, class one contractor and supplier NPWD, and also the president of the Alumni Association of our college.
for sparing his time to be part of this event. Your presence itself is an inspiration to us. Thirdly, I would like to thank our keynote speaker, Professor Siwashis Biswas, Pro Vice Chancellor Asami, who have traveled all the way from Difu Assam to join us for our third erudite fest. Sir, we are deeply grateful for your presence. Thank you for taking the trouble to be with us today. It was indeed a great privilege for us to be able to listen to your insightful thoughts and knowledge. I would also like to thank our principal, the administrator, our PG coordinator, and the management for giving us all the necessary help and support. I would also like to express my gratitude to all the special invitees, head of departments, my fellow friends from the Students' Council, our media friends from Kohima Press Club, and everyone present here. Thank you so much everyone for being part of the third Erudite Fest 2024 and making this event a grand success. Have a wonderful time. Thank you. Nagaland TV, Sop Manulaga Awas. Watch us live on Geo TV and on your television sets as well. For Dumapu viewers, we are on channel number 994 in Global Chapter and Kohima and Mokokchong viewers, switch to channel number 138 on Hornbill Digital. For all news and updates, follow us on Facebook, Instagram, YouTube and Twitter.